The governor not backing down from his executive order in a lawsuit filed against him and the state education board. That suit is happening as Broward County doubles down on its mask mandate. CBS 4's Keith Jones is live at Fort Lauderdale High School where a protest concerning masks is set to happen before the school begins. Keith, good morning. Yeah, good morning. Yeah, once again, that mask mandate is going to take center stage right here at Fort Lauderdale High School. You have a young lady. Her name's Isabel. She has tried to show up to school. She's willing to go to school, but she won't wear a mask, and apparently she's been denied access to school. Once again, she'll show up again today, bringing the center of this mask mandate right here to South Florida. Day two of a legal duel in Tallahassee. At issue, whether to move forward with a lawsuit brought by Florida parents against the governor and other state education officials over masks. The governor himself taking the stand yesterday. Going forward, we believe that parents uh, can make decisions about their, their child's health and safety. The governor making it very clear he's concerned about students' futures if forced to wear masks now. There was zero controversy about the data, but it was almost as if that data didn't exist. And then this idea that we have to put plastic dividers and some of the nonsense that you've seen, um, I just think it's going to have long-term implications. Since this three-day hearing began Monday, another school district is now ignoring the governor's directive. Governor DeSantis, stop being a bully. Stop being a bully. Stop putting politics before our children. Stop putting politics before our families. Attorney Charles Dodson representing the parents group, once again arguing the Florida Constitution prohibits the governor from legally banning school masks, citing two provisions here. One makes a safe and secure school a paramount duty of the state, and the other provides the local boards shall operate and supervise the schools. The second day of Tallahassee tussle coming as a small group of anti-mask protesters gather in Broward County. Unmask our children! Unmask our children! The Broward School Board responding to the state's demand Friday that it drop the mandate and allow parents to opt out, arguing it's up to individual school boards. What we're concerned about here in Broward County is our students, our staff in this community. So once again, her name is Isabel. She is a student here at Fort Lauderdale High School. Plans to show up here today with her father. No mask. She's going to try to gain entry once again. We'll let you know how that plays out. And there's supposed to be a staged protest or a demonstration right here on the sidewalk where I'm standing. We'll let you know how that plays out a little later this morning. Live at Fort Lauderdale High School, Keith Jones, CBS4 This Morning.